the Kenya medical practitioners, pharmacists and dentists is threatening that its members will go on strike in solidarity with their Secretary General, Dr. Davdri Atela, who was hit by a tear gas canister and injured during protests in Nairobi. KMPDU National Chairman Dr. Agidan Mwachi, who addressed the media in Mombasa County, calling on authorities to conduct thorough investigations and bring to book the person who injured Dr. Atta. At the same time, Dr. Mwachi opposed the rollout of Social Health Insurance Fund, lamenting that doctors will lack comprehensive coverage and will be forced to dig deeper into their pockets. Hence, once in the financial situation where many healthcare workers are already facing. Internet doctors are sent on internship as a prerequisite for them to be registered and the total number of interns right now waiting to be deployed is around 1,600 those are doctors and they're supposed to serve internship for one year and that is to say that they want to manage the emergency departments as you see it and after that they cannot be registered until they complete the internship. We all know that the National Health Insurance Fund yes, was beleaguered with corruption issues and the government is well placed to capture the corrupt uh, official officers in the National Health Insurance uh, Scheme. However, in its own wisdom, but mostly lack of it, they choose to bundle the house and reintroduce the scheme under very amorphous circumstances, then in that they forget something called comprehensive insurance. We gave our notice, they received, and thank God in our office we have our copy that was stamped and approved. Of course, by Kenyan law, we don't need any permission by the police to pick it. We just need to alert them. But on this one, they granted us and even told us the routes to follow up to treasury. That's why we don't understand why they would then turn around and use violence on people who are nothing but peaceful. 